Generally, in monetary policy, it uh, uses interest rates and in the circulation of notes and coins. Now, in this uh, question, we're looking at A. Now, if the rate increases, then the borrowing falls and investment consumption will fall. Therefore, the AD will fall. If the exchange rate increases, then the pound will appreciate, exports will fall, imports will fall, and the AD will fall again. Level of government expenditure is a fiscal policy, so that will fall as well. The answer is C. Why? Because an increase in the amount of money in circulation will lower interest rates. Now, what I've done is I've actually demonstrated this in the diagram below. And what I've shown over here is R stands for interest rates. So you've got R1, R2, and this is the quantity demanded of money for our household consumption and investment. So if the bank increases the quantity from S to S2, so the number of coins and notes have been increased in the economy, what happens is we can see the interest rates will fall down. Now, when the interest rate falls down, the firms will get cheap loans for investment. The household consumption will go up, so you can buy a car or a TV or a cheaper finance. And that is why what we are saying is Eddie will increase, and hence C is the answer. Thank you.